our rights. And we can even go on demonstrations as long as they're peaceful, you know, to register our protest and so on. I mean, the NDC has raised cogent points. The EC has also raised cogent points about its timetable and its schedule for this election. And come December 7th, there's going to be an election. How can we go past this? For us, that is the most important thing. We think it's gone beyond the NDC. Some of the issues that they have raised, which have been um, agreed to by the EC, and which the EC says it has subsequently corrected, you know, are for us important issues. But we can't make it just an NDC EC issue. Stakeholders must be involved. And stakeholders include other political parties. Stakeholders include um, the parliament, uh, other civil society organizations, you know, interested parties, even swing voters, okay? It is important because any anything that uh, disenfranchises anybody, five, ten people, we know all of these things are very important. And, 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 and voting patterns showed you that one vote matters. So for us, it's important that we look at this issue from a non-confrontational stance. We need to bring in stakeholders to examine the credibility or otherwise. And this can be done around the table all over the world, including uh, Africa, the sub-region, and so on. There are mediatorial approaches to these things. If you look at what the EC has said so far, including their recent statement, if you look at what the NDC has continually expressed in the media, for example, and I listened to Mr. Sami Jenfis very closely the last time, you would see there are points of convergence. Even the NPP statement says, in the first instance, that they don't disagree with any political party, raising credible issues for everybody to, you know, to do something about, about those issues, okay? They have done so in the past. They don't oppose it. If you take even these three parties, you would see they, there are issues, there are places of convergence. Let's look at those places of convergence and look at those places that seem to have a divergence, okay? Mm. And move past it. Why? There are many right-thinking people in this country, leaders of civil society, traditional religious leaders, and these things have happened before. This is not the first time that, you know, uh, a, the, a schedule of a commission can be, quote-unquote, interrupted to look at a complaint of a party. It happened with the VCRAC uh, committee uh, in 2016. It happened under Farijan. Mm -hmm. And when, when I listened to uh, Mr. Sambi Jemfi, he said, we are not asking for a, a strange audit, okay? People think uh, because we use the word forensic, it means something that's going to go on forever because we are looking at criminality and all of that. Bring your IT specialist. Let every political party bring their IT specialist. This is what I heard him say, okay? Let's get a few independent observers, and we have. And let's examine the issues, okay? So for me, I think we should stretch it beyond the NDC and the MPP. Um, going on demonstration after demonstration, let's remember the context within which we operate. We are the only country in which we haven't had terrorist attacks, even though there are terrorist cells all around us and sleeping cells in, in the country. You know, we don't want to adopt the kind of posture that puts the sword into the baby and cuts it apart. If we all love Ghana, if MDC loves Ghana, NPP loves Ghana, we want to preserve it as a whole baby. We don't want a sword through that baby. And therefore, if we can sit around the table and say, you know, what is your point here and what is your point here? Let's examine it. We can take this forward. Come December 7th, there will be an election. Our hope is that we can get through this because it has been done before. This won't be the first time the EC is stopping, quote unquote, a process to examine somebody's um, 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 complaints about its systems. And so we, we need to look at the issues very clearly as to what we have now. Pick the points of convergence, pick the points of divergence. It can be down around the table. There's no rocket science to this. That is our position. Okay.